conspirators. We played with a guy named Slash. He played in a band called Guns N' Roses. <laughs> Guns N' Roses. <laughs> band. Oh, and yeah. that's Frank. Okay. Hello. Excellent. And you're Excellent. Dave. I'm Dave. Right yeah. Um, long story. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> tell us. I didn't used to let's have a. Uh, let's uh, kill no. all the interview time telling that story. Yeah, let's tell my. No, let's not <laughs> tell my story. <laughs> you are playing today at the uh, Bandit Rock Awards. That's right. Yeah. Yes, and you are nominated as best female female fronted act, right? Female no. fronted act. Yeah. Uh, no. When Todd singing. Hopefully not. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Damn it! Damn it! No, no, we're, we're, just, uh, we're nominated for best rock album this year. Actually. Rock album, that's what yeah. it is. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. I actually did the research. I know. Oh, you did. Yeah. did. You did. You uh, did. For what album, album then? Also. Apocalypse. Do you know this? <laughs> yes. Our album. Excellent, excellent. Hopefully, it's our album that we're not able. Yeah, it could be, could be. <laughs> uh, do you think you'll win? We hope um, so. Have I'm you hoping it's gonna, someone? If it's decided by a knife fight, absolutely. Knife <laughs> 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 fight. <laughs> like in thriller video or something. Yeah, exactly. It's gonna be like the beat thriller, it. the beat it video by Michael beat Jackson. It, you know, yeah. Tie a band together and you gotta kind of knife it out. Right. <laughs> we'll win. Okay. We're, we'll win that. That's it. We'll win that. We rehearsed. Yeah, we, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Already set up. Do you bribe people to kind of win awards? I I can't really say. Do you? No, yeah. I've never done that. Mm. I can't really say. So there's more. There's threatening. There's threat threats. Okay. Like more that. more more threats. intimidation. Uh, yeah. Okay. So we'll come and play, and then you'll get your ass. <laughs> exactly. You don't win. Give me an award, and we'll come play. <laughs> <laughs> no. yeah. Perfect. Uh, you're going out on tour again. Mm-hmm. We've been out on tour since. Technically, we've been out on tour since two thousand and ten, but we broke to take to make a record, and then now we've been out since about a year, almost a year. A yeah. year. Yeah. Tired. One year. Oh yeah. Oh Exa- yeah. Exhausted. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But caffeine will get you through. Functioning well on coffee. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. European coffee is the best coffee. Of course, Swedish coffee is also. I know, right? The very best. Lay it mm-hmm. on me. How is it to play with Slash? Because it's Slash and you're kind of his band. Is he a... He definitely like, makes it feel like a group. Good person. Like, are we allowed to talk to him? <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, you, yeah can yeah. you actually speak to him or do you have time? When his security guard lets Only us via time text. With him, yeah. We don't mm, look okay. at him. No eye contact. <laughs> Only text. <laughs> and that's okay. He's a really good texter and so are we. Yeah. Okay, so you have he his number. Knife you have his phone so number. Right? No, so he's, a, he's actually a really, really amazing guy to play with. He's really... Cool guy, really laid back, California style laid back, and it's yeah, it's been really awesome, yeah. and very driven, and very very focused and motivating, driven. very driven artist keeps us on our toes. Cool, cool. A pleasure to play with. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I was going to ask you about the Swedish. Uh, you have your my electric, electric boys, boys with Connie. Yeah. yeah. I figured he I'm in is. Sweden, I should represent. True. He had Europe on earlier, but he switched. Yeah, I interviewed him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> my multiple European... Which which one is the best, Electric Boys or Europe? I'm more of an Electric Boys man myself. Okay. Who else is from you? I'm trying to think who else is from ABBA. Sweden. ABBA. Oh, yeah. Come on. Yeah, ABBA. Mm-hmm. Yeah. ABBA. There's the big one. One of the greatest there. pop bands ever. Opeth. Yeah, Opeth. Opeth. <laughs> Hammerfall. Like Opeth. Hammerfall. 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 Yeah. Yngwie. 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 There's a lot of great bands from... Sweden. Yeah, it's kind of like we don't we're, have we're Canadian, else to do. <laughs> and we like there's a lot of bands from Canada too. But over here, it seems like Sweden has the, the similar weather too. Mm, yeah. True, yeah. true. But you have Nickelback, right? That's true. <sighs> <Don't> <laughs> you, you had to go there. <laughs> so let's talk about Rush. No, I'm let's sorry. Just move right yeah, to Rush. let's talk about Rush instead. Yeah. <laughs> no, Thank you. I'm sorry. <laughs> Or Loverboy. Frank's from Vegas. He's got um, the Killers, the Killers, and, uh, and the Killers. <coughs> we have the, the Killers are there. <laughs> yes. and, the killers. Uh, and back to um, you playing one of the greatest bands alive. Uh, do you still get nervous when you go up on stage now? If you've been out for like one year, do you still kind of? I think it's more of an excitement thing. You get excited, you know. Yeah, I would say that. I don't. I, if there's I, family or something. I don't know. Maybe that's. If there's people that you've never never seen you play, I think that's that kind of brings on the nerves a bit. But it's more okay. so we just get excited. Sometimes it's more nervous if it's a smaller, intimate crowd. Like we've been doing a theater or a smaller place and then a giant arena. And sometimes that giant well, arena, you're like, it's so far removed. You know, festivals even more so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tens of thousands of people it just definitely the smaller rooms that make you feel like when I can see their eyes, I'm just like, Oof, it's like very. <laughs> 
Yeah, it's a different energy, so. Get nervous? Yeah. Make, I, don't, I don't really get nervous. I, I don't, you know. I, I think I enjoy it so much that it doesn't really. I suppose if I was supposed to perform surgery on someone, I might be a little more, ser- you know, nervous. But, mm. but this kind of stuff. Nobody dies. I think we, if we you know. Hit yeah, exactly. Yeah. No. If I get the wrong note, no one's going to die. But it's the, you know, we like to do this, so it's like getting up on the stage is like is a pleasure, you know. So I don't really, it doesn't really make me nervous, actually. Slash actually gets anxious, you know. Not, not I wouldn't okay. say nervous, but he definitely has an, an energy that he, you know, he's kind of focused up when he goes on stage. You kind of have something you you cheer each other on, you stand in, in a group and... Actually, no, there's none of that, you know. Yeah. That whole, like, you just, it's, yeah, there's no sports huddle. Type. No sports huddle, yeah, exactly. No sports huddle. None of that, but yeah. we're, we're close, like we're a good hang. We don't, yeah. like, not like each other, we actually enjoy hanging out, so... We're usually, you know, everyone's sort of warming up together. You know, it's not like we don't see each other before the gig and then we just kind of meet on stage. We're all like, uh, it's a, you know, it's a real family band kind of. That's what makes it excellent, right? Mm-hmm. Totally. I like to think. think so, yeah, yeah. I mean, I've definitely been in bands that were not like that, and there's a reason I'm not in those bands. Yeah. Um, <laughs> right? Because there's a lot more to it than just exactly, someone being yeah. good at something and. and mm-hmm. Yeah, it's like, like a, right? some sort of chemistry on and off stage that works too like you know you gotta like the people you play with or you know it's not easy to be out here for years on end with you know you can't stand people. each people other can, yeah, no. yeah. I mean sense. and we all know bands that have that happen right and we're all fans of some of those bands but you, you keep reading about the drama and it's just like <laughs> I wish I could tell you there's some crazy drama going on here but kind of like you know we're pretty okay with each other so and Slash is very yeah. you know he's a great hang so okay yeah excellent who is uh Who's the craziest drunk? Drunk? Yeah. There's no drinking in this band. Can no you believe it? Can all. you believe it? We're the most boring band in rock and roll. <laughs> Except for all the knife fighting. <laughs> <laughs> so you're but more like a that, Finnish band than with knives. Exactly, yeah. Oh, no, okay. no, there's actually, I mean, Slash has been clean for, I have no idea how long Slash has been clean. And sort of that kind of, not that it's like some sort of rule, but we just kind of, it's not a party band. Even though he wouldn't care, we know he, he wouldn't, wouldn't care. care. It's just it it's one. just something that yeah we just we just yeah that the whole not on the road that aspect of it is kind of I mean the our our schedule is so punishing and so ongoing that there's just no way you would be able to function if you were like you know hurting every day because we uh, you know we have a very high level of expectation for ourselves yeah, so course. yeah okay excellent. Right. That is kind of a kind of cool thing to do, actually. Well, it's not really like a, like I say like a like a a rule or like a thing. We just kind of like it's it's more about playing music than it is about being out here chasing girls and you know partying. Who did write uh, the record you're up uh, nominated for? How do you write? Do you write music together? Uh, well. Or how does it? How well, Slash is sort of the uh, the forerunner musically, and then Miles comes in with lyrics and and uh, and uh, melodies and whatnot. And we collectively sort of did the record together. But those two guys are good at coming up with ideas. They've got a great chemistry. You know, in a you know hotel room on a you know a phone, you write some ideas down and quickly. They kind of it's amazing how fast. Yeah. yeah, they've been like so good with those two guys. Really gel great with you know I've got a riff, I've got a melody. Boof, Without getting too detail oriented, and then we just kind of like they kind of we all come in together and go, let's just make it a band thing, yeah. and and everyone there's no like, okay, I, I I think the drum part should be this, and I think you know like we all just sort of jump on it. We were jumping on music today mm-hmm. in sound check. It's just like we're already continually working. That's on the way the last albums. album worked too: sound checks, jamming, rehearsals, and then it's the old-fashioned way, but it's the only way that seems to always, yeah. you know. Uh. We're not rewriting any any history book. It's just like get together with a bunch of musicians and you know flesh out some ideas and and hopefully you know and we all like the, the ideas and hopefully someone else likes it later on. Exactly. <laughs> well, apparently. Apparently. Yeah, it's done. I mean, the record's done really well. We're we just got a, some gold records in Poland just unexpectedly like last week. So we're like, oh wow, okay. <laughs> you just released a video for Anastasia as well, mm-hmm. and that was live pictures. It's live it in South America, Rio, yeah. or something like that. And a little bit of Australia, Australia, I think. Was there some Australian as well? A little yeah. bit. Oh. So we had some really good shows in Australia and South America, so I think it was like the best. Of the big, best. big Melded shows. them together. Yeah. Yeah, it looks great. It's yeah. weird to look okay. at the video and it like, 
like it's like an out of body experience. You look at it and go, wow, that's <laughs> the majority of that was shot in Brazil. I think that was uh, that first right. gig was in Rio, mm -hmm. yeah. and then you'll see bits and pieces of Australia. But yeah, it was it was amazing. Cool. Who decides that? Is it like yeah? Which was our, which were our best gig, or do you kind of like decide that in advance? In advance, I think they were, we're filming in South America, that knowing okay. that South America is, okay. you know, is South America. The yeah. audiences are <clears throat> there's people at the airport, there's people at our hotel. You know, I mean, it's like, you know, and then there's the concerts. It's just the energy level is just on ten all the time. Cool. Not that it's not anywhere else. It just, just so happens that there they're like particularly feverishly passionate about. It's a warm country. Exactly. Warm country. Exactly. Continent. There's no such thing as winter there, eh? Yeah. Exactly. Hi, we're the Conspirators. We play with Slash, Miles Kennedy, and the Conspirators. Todd, Brent, Frank, and you're watching Access Rock.